What's up everybody? It's Mighty Kyle Wayne here. Today I'm gonna build a uh, exhaust flapper for a little old, I call it a tractor. My wife says it's a lawnmower, but it's a damn tractor. So yeah, let's get at it. <clears throat> so the idea is this big flat washer. Put it like that. Put this little thin strip of metal. I think I'm gonna weld it on there like that. And then make me two arms run down here like this. Put a bolt through them. Maybe leave this long. It's like a like, like the regular one. It's got like a big counterweight piece to it. Kind of what I'm gonna try to do with the length of this. Yep, there's what it's gonna take. Oh yeah, I got this this black iron pipe. It screws in that. It's got like a bridge and stratton. The elbow comes out, it's just gonna screw in there. Put a little flapper on top. So, let's see what we can do. I got them cut, got a hose drilled. Uh, they ain't perfectly identical, but the hell they'll do for this project. I did set it on there like that. It's a little old cup and it's got a pre whatever that is casted in it. I think it'll make a good spacer. Well, the far out of it. I'll be back. All right. Hell, I got them welded on there. Half ass cleaned up. I mean, it ain't like it's gonna go on a show car. But uh, yeah. And that little strip I had, hell, it wasn't enough left over, so I'd wheel this out of another piece of bread. But yeah, I just made it big. But I think you know, have yeah, I'll wheel this out. You know, I think I'm gonna put this on here. Get it all lined up. Get my hole drilled, maybe tacked and cleaned up. And then we'll see how much to cut off. As far as weight goes, kind of round some stuff off and all that good stuff. But heck yeah! All right, I got her welded up, cleaned up, hole drilled, put a little bolt in it. Had to put a washer. Still got a little more slack than I'd like, but now we're gonna see. I think he's too heavy. I don't think it should be able to stay back like that. So, it's close. I believe what I'm gonna do is just wing it. Maybe start like that right there. Let me grab my marker. Yeah, I kind of want to maybe taper this down a little and then round this off pretty good. And, uh, I think we'll be all right. Maybe we'll see. All right. So uh, I think I got it. Kind of how I like it. I like the look. I like the weight. I think it'll be fine. It'll kind of quiet it down. But uh, it still get your level. Still goes too far, and it's like all the weight's going this way. So I need to weld me a little stop just about right there. I think I'll have her. Need a little more cleaning up. Cut this off. Maybe tack my nut on. Maybe try to work on getting a little more slop out of it. But, uh, got a little public service announcement. See this? Wear it. Use it. I there ain't no telling how many times I've had to dig stuff out of my eye. I've been up all night trying to dig stuff out of my eye with a tweezer and a magnet. I had to go to the eye doctor. He had to get this little old Dremel thing with a barb on it that was spinning about a billion mile an hour when he got close to me. And uh, he kind of like flanks whatever's in your eye out, but yeah. And I burnt my hands. I melted these two fingers nearly together one time when I was a kid, welding on a go kart. And I burnt fingers where they'd be so much where they'd numb for a month. I used to be the world worst thing. Man, I ain't got no time for to grab that stuff. You darn sure ain't got no time to run the eye doctor, so maybe that'll help somebody. Because I used to be the world worst. I've done more dumb than most. But, uh, yeah, get to the gear yourself. Yeah, let's get this project finished. All right. So I got her cut, got her cleaned up, butter my nut on there, put me a stop in here. All that's left is a uh, 
I'll put it on the tractor. I can clean a lot more of this up, but I ain't worried about it. Hit her with some black paint. I get tired of looking at it rusty, but it's fine with me.